The following is a selected video from yourteacher.com where you can browse over 450 complete math lessons with example videos, interactive practice problems, self-tests, and more. Try a complete lesson today at yourteacher.com. Decimals are used to name values that are in between whole numbers. So the decimal 425.37 is in between the whole numbers 425 and 426. To find the place and value of the underlying digit, let's start with the place value chart. The digits to the left of the decimal have the same place values that we've used in the past. Units, tens, hundreds, and so on. But the digits to the right of the decimal will have new place values. We say that the digit just to the right of the decimal is the tenths place. The next digit to the right is the hundredths place, then comes the thousandths place, then the ten thousandths place, and so on. Notice that the tens place is two to the left of the decimal, but the tens place is one to the right. Make sure to keep this straight as you're finding place values. So for this problem, let's put our given number, 425.37, into the place value chart. Notice that we can fill in any empty positions at the end with zeros. Now we can see that the underlying digit, 7, is in the hundredths place. So the value of the digit 7 is 7 hundredths, which is written as 0 0.07. 